And it's time for Tech Tuesday. Timmy Moore live in the studio. And today we are talking about turning your television into a smart TV. And we've got the Asus Cube here, right? Exactly. Uh, what this, what, yeah, as you said, this is the Asus Cube with Google TV. All this is is the, the TV, it, this is just a home TV, just mm -hmm. the TV you have at home. And then what this little box is is actually the Cube. Mm -hmm. And what this Cube will do is it'll it works with your existing cable or satellite. So you can just plug and play right in. Mm -hmm. And what you can do is you get this remote and basically you know you're used to just flipping channels on your TV but you're not used to maybe getting the weather doing some productivity work watching a movie etc so what this device can do is let's say I just take its remote and I can flip through here like I got TVs and movies games social life Very sports cool. music etc so it's got all these apps because it's with Google mm -hmm. it also runs if you have an Android phone all your Android apps theoretically will run on this so let's say you have got Facebook on your phone Facebook will run on here so it's kind of like a platform that will be built for your TV. So it's kind of like your smartphone is coming to your TV. Just another way for you to integrate your systems and all into Exactly. One. So let's say, uh, just for example, let's say I want to browse the internet. I'll just go to Chrome right here. It'll bring up uh, my site here and I can just hit enter. And then there we go. I can scroll through it once it refreshes here. It'll just bring up the site. You can scroll through. And then what's cool is on this uh, remote you get here is you can turn on the mouse function here. And this, this touchpad, this, the, this is the remote it comes with, oh, and this wow. touchpad actually becomes your mouse. So if you didn't like clicking around with the pointer, you can actually just touch the screen. You can see my mouse moving there, and then I can click on an article. Very cool. And it will load up here. There we go. So lots of cool features if I hit home here. I can also do a search. Now, I don't know how well this will work since it's got a little, uh, so I can say like things like weather. That is that is really interesting, and we'll see. It may not p be able to pick it up, well, but even even so, so this is this is really cool technology. As we mentioned, another way for you to integrate your home systems and all into one, and it, essentially it's turning your TV just into a computer. Exactly. Uh, but your your TV that you have now, some people were saying that okay, well, can I ditch cable now? Because I got all these services. I got like Amazon. I got mm -hmm. HBO Go. I got Netflix on here. Can I finally ditch cable? Um, it, it will uh, work with your cable feed, so people don't need to worry about that. You can just click here. Now, it's not going to work. I won't click it because it will just be static, right, right, but right. it will it'll just pop up your TV. So you, if the argument that you can ditch cable and satellite is not quite there yet because shows are still not on demand, you can't grab that content, but you, you really do expand what your TV can do. You can run apps, you browse the web, and all these different sorts of things. Like if I just pop into the App Store here. How much? Very interesting. Yeah, how much does it yeah. cost? There, there you go. Yeah, it, it's actually very affordable. It starts at one thirty nine ninety nine, depending on where you look at. Like Newegg.com will sell it to you for one thirty nine ninety nine. Very cool. Very cool. All right, thank you, Timmy Moore.